Hello and welcome to the JBNM Sports Fanatic channel. Thank you for joining for some more NFL news. And the Carolina Panthers have been very busy this week. They went ahead and got out what we presume to be their starting quarterback earlier in the week, brought in the offensive lineman yesterday, and now they're bringing in um, A.J. Boye, who's looking to be their starting cornerback um, to fill a need that they definitely had on that defense. And so that is huge. And when you're going against someone like Tom Brady twice a year, you know, Matt Ryan, um, and whoever um, the Saints throw out there, whether it's Jameis, um, Winston, or Taysom Hill, you're definitely going to want to make sure that you have your secondary secure. That's just a requirement if you want to compete, especially in the NFC. Guys like Aaron Rodgers and company, Russell Wilson, the list goes on. So, yeah, this is definitely a big sign in here. Um, and AJ, he's been on um, with a couple teams. He's He started off his career with the Houston Texans when he came out of Central Florida. Um, and he played for the Houston Texans for four seasons before playing with the Jacksonville Jaguars. And in Jacksonville, he made his first Pro Bowl and um, only Pro Bowl going to the 2017 season. And that season, he recorded six interceptions and 56 tackles. And then he finished out um, his career in Jacksonville in 2019 and played 2020 with the Denver Broncos just um, last season. Throughout his career, he has totaled 14 interceptions and has had 338 tackles. So they're getting a guy that's definitely coming in with some experiences. He's been in the league dating back to 2013. So he's going to definitely be an upgrade at that cornerback position for them, someone that they can go out there and rely on. I mean, he's not as young as he used to be, but he's still a good corner nonetheless. And so this is a good move for the Carolina Panthers. I like it. So we'll see how this plays out for them and what other moves they have in store. And as always, as more NFL news continues to drop, you can definitely find it here. So thank you so much for your support, checking out the video. I really appreciate it and look forward to talking with you guys next time.